The world's biggest jeweler, Pandora, says it will no longer use mined diamonds, instead selling only lab-made sparklers. So why the change? Let's connect the dots. Diamonds may be a symbol of enduring love, but there is a lot of blood, sweat, and tears before they land in that velvet jewelry box. In Africa, where many of Earth's diamonds are mined, the gems have helped finance violent civil wars, fed corruption, and propped up brutal dictators. Miners on the continent are not just underpaid, they are also physically abused. Experts also estimate over 70 countries use child labor to get diamonds out of the ground. Then there is the environmental impact. While in some countries diamond mining is heavily regulated, there are just as many where it is not. This has led to deforestation, rivers being rerouted, and land stripped of its topsoil. For impoverished countries, this can be devastating to farmers who have depended on those resources for generations. So what's a lab-grown diamond? Let's just say these aren't rhinestones, they are the real thing. But instead of being drilled out of the ground, scientists grow them in a lab. They use carbon and subject it to high temperatures and pressure, mimicking the natural process. The resulting diamonds are identical to the ones found in the earth, plus lab-made diamonds are cheaper, meaning you can shine bright like Rihanna without spending like her.